Hey everyone, I'm Elon Rosenberg, the writer, director of the Warriors Maccabee, Fight for the Holy Land. First and foremost, I really want to thank all our backers and supporters for helping us reach our first milestone, $20,000. I really, really appreciate this helping me achieve my dream. In honor of this milestone, we've added a new reward. It's our stunt course reward. It's a 10-week course for only $225, where you will learn everything from high falls, break falls, weapons, fight choreography, all the good stuff you need to know to make it in this industry. I personally want to thank you guys for donating. I'd like to thank you from the very bottom of my heart. It's phenomenal. So come on up, sign up for that reward. Like our page, share it, tell your friends. Any, anything to get the world to get more backers to help support us so we can make our goal a reality. It would be amazing. Please check out our video pitch right now. For all of recorded history, the fight for the Holy Land has raged. Many heroes fought. Many lives lost. Fight for the Holy Land is actually the Hanukkah story. Most people who know Hanukkah really only know a small portion of it, which is the Festival of Lights. There was enough oil to have lights for one day, but it lasted eight days. And that's pretty much what people understand. But what people don't know, there is a, a, a much bigger part, which is the story of Matig Yahu and his sons, the Maccabees. This is a story about faith. This is a story about perseverance. This one man and his sons defeated an entire army. This is one of those great biblical stories that just hasn't been seen. We are the chosen people. Hi, my name is Louis Paquette. I'm a stuntman and fight coordinator. I've been doing this for 20 years. I work on films such as 300, The Incredible Hulk, Pacific Rim, White House Down. We're using a lot of different types of martial arts that we're going to combine a certain way. Every single character has their own martial art attached to them. So one guy will be all Wushu, one guy will be Krav Maga, one guy will specialize in staff. It's never really been answered what happened. How can seven people defeat 1,000 people? That was never like, documented anywhere, so it's open to interpretation. So my interpretation is simple. God gave him superpowers. What makes that so interesting is that it, it combines this modern mythology of how we tell these epic stories nowadays with superheroes with this historical epic from the Torah. We've got the best stunt guys, the best VFX teams, the best uh, studios behind us, suppliers, even William F. White International. We're going to be shooting one more day with the Mocha Bolt. It's a robotic arm with multiple articulation. We're going to be shooting it with a phantom camera, so super slow motion. And we're creating a very unique fight choreography for that. It's never been done before. Now all that's left is the VFX work, the special effects. We're appealing for some funding to complete that. These are finishing funds so that we can make the visual effects look every bit as good as the stunts and the fights and the wire work and everything else that we've been able to shoot so far. Back in this project, you can get rewards such as a digital copy of the ebook that the film is based on, The Warriors Maccabee, digital copy of the film, we have t-shirts, we have an executive producer credit we're giving away. Private lessons from myself, which is the Israeli commando Krav Maga system, learning how to defend yourself. There's lots of great opportunities. So we're going to shoot one more scene, it's this massive fight scene, and we're giving away a select few walk-on roles, and you can be a part of it. We've actually took the 300 idea and meshed it with the Avengers. It's superheroes, it's uh, Avengers meets 300. Honestly, this is the biggest short film you guys are ever going to see. It's in right now, and I think it's the perfect timing to do it. I think it's very important to the Jewish community, to the people around the world, to, to understand what we had to go through. To me, it's as big as Moses and the Ten Commandments, King David, Noah, all that. We fight! <laughs>